And we are back for more Total War today, everybody. As we push south to destroy uh, those darn people who uh, have our city right now. I, I, I totally want it. It's, it belongs to us. It definitely does. So, uh, but first we have to crush the rebellion that's popping out of the city here. Uh, we have, uh, they finally left. So now uh, peace is, is at hand. But we need to crush this force. Luckily, they're only four units big. Uh, somewhat elite, somewhat really armored, really, really well, uh, tough guys. But it's okay. We're going to go here. We're going to smash them right now. And, oh, not this game again. They better not run this time. I think we got them cornered now. As we run through the hot deserts, uh, they will fall. Oh, you know what? Let's just do an auto-resolve result on this one here. Uh, let's go aggressive since we outnumber them to, like, billions. So there we go. Take those rebels out. And all is well. And it appears the Romans might want some of their old towns back. And I'm not going to give it to them. No siree. We're going to have to keep an eye on them. We have forces up north that I think can go ahead and come down south if we absolutely need them to. Uh, almost. They, they can almost reinforce us. Although we do have forces in the desert here. Could they actually reinforce the city if it was under trouble? No, they couldn't. Oh, and I don't know if the Romans know that or not. They probably do since they're a computer and the computer is a genius. Oh, we've got some trouble brewing. Okay, so let's take a look at the map here. Let's let's just take a look and look at this. Okay, so we got crazy, crazy monkey Romans running this way to destroy our hard-earned and deserved and built lands. Uh, these guys scared the crap out of me. And, uh, and then we have another army coming from the south once again. We have no time to go ahead and charge down here and bash this into pieces. Because, uh, because we're, we are, we are in pieces right here. Luckily, we're starting to resupply ourselves a little bit, but we're gonna have to head down over this way, back into this town, and defend it against all these Romans that are coming this way. So let's go ahead into the, uh, sprinting stance, and run as fast as we can. Oh my gosh, can we not do this? Can we not do it? Get out of here, we can do this, come on. Come on, let's, 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 uh, let's run across the desert, it's fine, it's fine. It's no big deal. And then we get there, and then we can run some more, right? No, that's not the case. Okay, we're, we're dead. <laughs> we're dead. We're so dead. There's no way we're going to get through this. Um, oh, wait, here we go. Yes, we can. All right. Uh, let's reinforce one another, friends. Wait, how come, how come that little sprint icon didn't do the trick? I don't know. But okay, let's go send these armies down here as well. Give them a force to reckon with. Uh, maybe they'll leave us alone or something like that. Okay, good. So it shows that little yellow line there. Okay, so we're reinforcing each other up there. And, uh, yeah, hopefully, uh, I don't want to trade. I don't want to trade coin with you guys. All right, so, uh, let's pass the turn and see how hard we die here. And it looks like the Romans are moving in to attack us. Luckily, we have all our forces. I even hired in some, uh, mercenaries at the very end there. Uh, I'm very thankful for this that they didn't go after our town. That's, that's very nice. Um, okay, so, it seems like we have the advantage. Uh, they weren't assuming that we were going to reinforce each other. I guess they were. But I don't know how we're going to beat this. These guys are super elite. Look how tough these guys are. So it's going to be one of those battles uh, with the whole high mountainous terrain, uh, treesy kind of things, and us not being able to see our enemies until it's too late. Luckily, we have some guerrilla deployment here, so we sent some guys over here, some guys over here. Let's start the match and wait for our reinforcements to pile on in. Uh, hopefully, they start coming in. <laughs> and when they do... Oh, okay, so we can actually see some enemies right now. Okay, let's let's take a look at what we can actually see here. Okay, oh, wow. The enemy has reinforcements. Looks like they're moving pretty quick. They have reinforcements too, darn it, yeah. So I'm hoping we can just take this hill with what we have. Oh, cool, we got some guys coming in here as well. Uh, right, the additions, uh, the backups, reserves, but hopefully, uh, I don't know, we'll see. We'll see when they get here. The enemy. Pretty much you gotta run them up the field, wherever the heck they're coming from. Where, where are they coming from? Oh, they're coming from over here. Uh-huh, oh my gosh. Wait a second. Oh, wait, oh, okay, over here, right, 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 yes. Okay, so they are, uh... Actually, no, this is kind of perfect. We could actually flank around. We could flank the enemy on this line here. And we're putting ourselves into a shield wall formation here as I was speeding up time, oh my goodness. Uh, we have all our troops... Oh, that was pretty rough, that was pretty rough, okay. Join in and help your, your brethren there, uh, men. Uh, most of these guys, are they still hiding? No, not really. Okay, let's go ahead and, uh, my goodness, this camera's like going bananas. Let's swing around like this. These guys are still all hidden up here on this ridge. I think I might just start swinging them around as well. Uh, at least, yeah, yeah, these guys need to get involved, like, uh, immediately. So here we go. Let's swing them in this way. 
And all right, and what's going on over here? All right, it's gonna be a very fluid battle, constantly adjusting, uh, and constantly uh, charging. Let's let's get the heck all in here. Let's get some guys in here. Come on, everybody, charge on in, nice messy style. Uh, same with you guys here. Looks like the onagers are shooting off on their side as well, which is not very good. Not very good for us. But it seems like okay, we have. <laughs> Oh, okay, we got we got these guys right here. Let's go ahead and do the shield wall on these guys real quick. Because I guarantee these these cavalry, these horses are gonna Oh, and then we got some assaults going on here. Let's see if we can get shield. No, it's too late for shields. And they are bombing us like all crazy. Oh my goodness. Okay. Make sure you guys get it. Get it, get it. Okay, everybody go that way. Where the heck are these guys going? I have no I have no clue. Alright. Shield wall. Form the line. Get ready. <laughs> Brace yourselves. These cavalry are going at 100 miles an hour. And yeah, this is whatever, man. Whatever. <laughs> all right. So um, I, th I think we're gonna do all right here. I think nonetheless we'll do we'll do just fine. If we just charge everybody in here and just smash everything up as best as we uh, as we can do. Why are these guys walking this way? We need to swing some troops over this way. And some to go over around this way, if at all possible. Oh boy, these enemies are fast. All right, so here we go. We got some assaults coming in from the behind, uh, <laughs> and it looks like it's enough to throw these guys off their guard. Uh, blood and guts everywhere, and onager. Oh, oh boy, yeah, yeah, yeah. Blood and guts, indeed. Uh, but okay, so we are fighting, and uh, fighting is going on. We have men coming in from the top here, charging these guys. This is going to be real good. Finally, we had a chance to move these guys into play. Uh, somebody chase these archers the heck out of here. I wish we had some cavalry, but what you're going to do can't have it all. Uh, everybody here, charge the general. Those slingers can get assaulted by uh, these fellows here. And these guys can keep attacking these guys. Okay, very good, very good. So everyone's just, just bashing and smashing. Going away. <laughs> what a mess over here. Um, we should really swing some more troops. Well, looks like they're starting to flee, though. Who do we have over here? Their archers running? Okay. Uh, these guys are just <laughs> doing a jolly walk. <laughs> Let's have them jolly walk over here and <laughs> use their swords. Uh, and these guys are walking as well. Okay, so, all right, I guess just keep the slingers busy. They're almost out of ammo anyway. Fighting the general's unit here. Uh, this, is, this is a pretty messy battle. Chaotic. Uh, didn't go as planned or as expected, but what you gonna do? I mean, that's war, you know, that's, that's what happens. But I think we have everyone outnumbered enough to win this thing. At least I think. And now we are coming around here to go ahead and finish, finish the dirty work here. This is gonna be awesome. Oh darn, I don't want you guys going either. I want you guys staying here. Attack these guys. For crying out loud, go there, go there, fight these guys. They're just like regrouping. This is gonna be awesome though. <laughs> All right, these guys are officially surrounded. These Romans right here. These were the ones the Algili I was worried about. And it seems like, yes, they have their hands full of uh, barbarians all over the place. That's very good. These guys are running off here. Very good. And these swordsmen. I tell you what, everybody just attack like this unit and just swing around and cause chaos. And that's very good. These guys are still fighting out over here? Really? Wow, these guys are tough. These spearmen are just like taking a lot of hits. But okay, so I think zooming out on the battle here, I think we have this pretty much won here. Pretty much won. Got our swordsmen chasing these guys off the field. So by the time they're done with that, they can just run over here. Uh, let me get these guys still going here though. There we go. Keep running. Keep chasing them. Keep chasing them. These guys are still chasing the slingers. Good. Chase them out of here. Uh, these, these slingers are fleeing. These guys are still fighting. Still fighting. Looks like they're all fleeing over there. Okay. Well... It wasn't pretty, but heck, I think I think we're all mostly still alive. That's a very good thing. It's very good. And we did a good job here. We uh, made them flee the battlefield, even though it wasn't the, the cleanest of victories. Uh, it's still a victory nonetheless. It looks like we've taken down their numbers pretty well, so I don't think they're going to be bothering anyone anymore. Or at least the garrisons at our uh, small little towns. Execute any of the prisoners. And, oh, they still have one large force right over here, though. These guys. Hmm... Well, I think we're in a good position to just sit back at home and just resupply 
our, uh, our empty. And as the turns pass, we are getting raided. Oh, rebellions everywhere. We got raided over here. These people are so miserable. Buildings are just literally bashed down to the ground. <laughs> this is like, if we can, uh, can we actually go ahead and, like, uh, abandon this place? Like, can we, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, let's abandon this. That'd, that'd be good. That'd be very good if we, if we can actually do that. Uh, I might get taken over or raided once again. Who knows? Uh, we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you what. All right, so let's uh, let's head back over this way. We need to need to occupy these cities. Oh, there's some more Roman troops coming over here. I, I was wondering when they were gonna come back and really start causing us the pain. Uh, you know what? Let's let's move down here. Let's move down here with our troops. Because uh, we're still pretty we're still pretty strong. We're not we're not like down and out yet. So if we can just move down here. And start a fight, pick a fight with one of these units. I think we could finally finish off these armies here. I mean, there's really nothing left. They're so weak right now. So, let's see if we can get a fight going here. They'll probably just run. Oh, they're staying. Oh, what a bunch of proud Romans. All right, well, let's mop them up then in the field. Looks like we got ourselves an onager. I don't even know where we got this thing from, but I guess the Romans have lent it to us since our last battle. Must have captured it or something. Didn't realize we could capture enemy forces. Looks like they're shooting some rocks at us. If that's the best that they can do, they've got... Oh, yeah, looks like they got more rocks. And more rocks. Oh, they have lots of rocks. Yeah. But we're still hanging in there. We're hanging in there. Look at these guys. They're like... Well, not this guy. Or this guy. Or these guys. Those... Oh, he's... Oh, my goodness. Oh, <laughs> the crows are flying. All right, so we're running on in here. Ready to go in the shield wall formation once we get a little bit closer because those shields ain't gonna do nothing against those onagers. Uh, but we're almost about ready to break on the enemy lines. Now we are swinging the door on these fine, poor sucker gentlemen. <laughs> we are, we are coming on in here. I might even send our general in here, honestly, against their general. Let's do it. Get these guys all up in here. We don't need no shield walls. We're just gonna run in here and smash these guys up real good, uh, sword slinging style. Uh, here we go. All right, and we have men going around the flanks here. This is gonna be our ace in the hole move Oh, I see they have some cavalry as well. That's fine. Let, let them have that cavalry. That's that's gonna be okay Let's rush around this way. These guys can go into here Take out their general as well, and that's gonna be all she wrote. Maybe I'll send like one unit over here to take out the back lines uh, One unit from each side. There we go. Just give these guys a little bit of trouble these men can go ahead and Yeah, just rush right on in here and there we go. This is going to be quite a catastrophe for, uh... <laughs> there they go. All right, so we have them surrounded. Uh, let's bring this down so we can get a good view of the fighting here. And, yeah, we are just cutting right through them. Like, nobody's business. This is awesome. Look at the, uh... <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right, so... That's pretty much all she wrote here. I, I can't sh actually know. Their general's still alive. He's over here. He's not quite being flanked. Let's take one of these units off. Just send them over here. Because we don't need all these units just fighting like... Actually, there's nothing even over here to fight any longer. So everybody go ahead and rush. Rush the general here. This this will be good old fight. And, yeah, no mercy indeed. I think he's gone now. I think he's literally trampled underneath our feet. Oh my gosh, we, we got the uh, en enemy general, but look at this fire pit right here. I just realized our onager is actually shooting now. Finally got itself in a position and lent a huge smoky fireball right there. It was hilarious. I wonder if it's going to shoot again. I want to see it shoot one more time. That was really cool. It just literally set that whole place on fire. Are you going to shoot again? Oh yeah, there it goes. Did it? Did it? Is it? Oh man, we really need to make some of these things. <laughs> look at them wind it down. Don't mess up, guys. Don't mess up. There's only one of you launching this thing. Oh my gosh, look at that. Where are they even shooting it? Probably at our own guys. Oh, I said I had this one thing. Oh, that was cool. Yeah, you better run for your life. Oh, yeah, they're shooting at him. <laughs> look at that fire damage. I love it. Well, I mean, it's kind of horrible. We are victorious, but there is quite a messy situation here as our enemies are running all down south. Uh, this place right here can go ahead and reinforce their cause if we try to attack them now. We have some Romans here, and I'm sure there's more Romans on the way by sea. Actually, yes, there are, right over here, oh my goodness. Yeah, that really stinks. Okay, so I think this is a good time now to turtle and pass a few, uh, maybe like dozen turns off camera, <laughs> just so we uh, rebuild our cities, or just, I, I guess, uh, continue, continue to improve our cities and, uh, and convert them and just reinforce our troops because we're all pretty much shot right now. I mean, like, our, troop, our troops are just like, you know, they're like half full and messed up and we got like some wolf coats in here, like, what's that all about? I don't know. 
And we'll probably, yeah, go ahead and destroy this place to the ground. Um, oh, you know what? Darn it. I guess we shouldn't really destroy it. Shouldn't really abandon it. Um, because one day I do want to take this over. So, okay, we'll, we'll just leave that like that for now. Let it go, like, all types of crazy. And, alright, so I'm going to rush us back to town. Uh, I guess these guys can go here. Okay, good. We are within range here, so we'll, we will go back here. Defend the city. Or the town. Very nice. And we'll get tons of replenishment. Get rid of these onagers. Because uh, we really don't need them right now. And we can make our own. And then these guys will also go back to this place over here. Hopefully we get some bonus movement if we go a leggy stance. There we go. So we can almost get there. That's good. Rush on back this way. It should be close enough to reinforce it if it gets attacked by these guys. So alright. A few turns off camera. Uh, reinforcing ourselves and resting. And during one of our turns, looks like our rebels have uh, popped out of this horrid place once again, and they are attacking it. And uh, I'm just gonna let them, like, you know, go ahead and like take it. Hopefully, they can take it and just claim it for the rebels themselves. That'd actually be the best party to own this place. Looks like they are taking it quite, quite nicely. And um, so, what are they gonna do? Just raid it again? I mean, it's already literally burnt to the ground. Oh, good, they took it. They claimed it. Oh, that's amazing. Oh, but now they're officially our rebels, or something like that. But, uh, but it's good, though. They claimed it, so now these guys are gonna fight these guys if they want to take it. Okay, good. It's not, it's like off our hands now. It's good. Alright, so just another enemy to fight, but they're all a bunch of suckers. Okay, so, continuing to lick our wounds, and look at us. We are looking good. We're in the money once again. And, yes. Okay, so, uh, this is very, very good. Gonna add some archers to our troops now, since we got our wood shop down here built up. A red here, wood carver, so we'll add some archers to the units, and yes, it's going to be a very good day. And just a little progress report of plans going on here. I'm noticing the Romans are circling us like a bunch of hungry uh, hyenas, and they are reinforcing and building and constructing in this place right here. So for us to take this over, it's going to be a little trickier than I thought. So uh, what I want to do is to finish converting this place into a barbarian village. And then putting just like a skeleton garrison here, like having its garrison and a small kind of a uh, force here, like maybe like half the size of this, just sitting here watching our north. Seems like our allies are making short work of the Romans too, weakening their empire. But uh, I want to have a small force there and then take down two full forces down south here to claim all this stuff. I think that's really what we need is two big forces to, uh, to take out all this and to claim all this land for our own. I think then... We won't have any problems. So, alright, it's going to take a lot of turns to pull this off, but I'm going to do this off camera. And I'll let you guys know if anything else uh, comes at us. Like, maybe these rebels don't even know what's fighting over here. But, uh, whatever's going on, it must be good if, if they're not coming to us. So, <laughs> alright, we're going to go ahead and convert this city over. And the war parties are forming. So let me show you what I did here. We have three units now. We have three troops. Uh, we have the Wooden Watch, which I've, I have just made a new order. Uh, these guys are to sit here and guard the north. And I have put our old, uh, our old uh, son here in charge. I think he's like 50 years old or something like that. Yeah, here he is. He's 51 years old, Wolfgar. Uh, he's going to go ahead and uh, watch the north for as long as he lives uh, in this new order. He was a little upset at first, but then we got his loyalty back. He's fine. <laughs> and then we have our faction heir who took over the new Budlandian order. Uh, so now he is leading this force, and so is our other uh, neighboring friend, our other uh, noble uh, from, from the call. So, so the family doesn't con control all the power. We have one of the nobles helping us out here. So the bros of Permafrost and the new Budlandian Order are reinforcing and they're getting all their stuff together. So we got 14 herdmen in each group and then a whole bunch of archers as well training up here. Uh, in three turns, they'll be good to go down south on their campaign of, of uh, total destruction. So I'm really looking forward to that. Uh, just got to let a few more turns pass, but oh my goodness, so much progress. Family heir and nobleman are on the crest of battle to go against the Romans here. And finally take this over once and for all. This looks like a huge force. Uh, I'm not sure about this rebel force out here, but I really feel like we need to clean up this uh, this house right here and reinforce our, uh, our ocean line. I think once we take these Romans out over here, they should be weak enough to where they can't reinforce as strongly as they have uh, before. Because they are, they are going down. They are being beaten back on all fronts by other forces as well. Like up here, for example, our allies have actually taken the city, which is nice, which is really nice. So... Uh, so hopefully they won't come for us. <laughs> but alright, so let's go ahead, move into position here to assault this city. I think we will have the faction heir lead the, lead the charge. Lead the assault here. Alright, let's have him go in. Alright, let's just... Here we go. Oh my goodness. 
Yeah, so this is a huge Roman force we have going on here. This is, this is an absolutely ginormous battle. Uh, we're going to need all the help we can get. Let's uh, encircle for now. Wow, that's, that's, that's a lot of guys. All right, and then let's also send in uh, these fellows right here, right on next to us, or as close as possible, so we can all reinforce one another. All right, so let's see what we have here. All right, we have a chance. We have a chance. All right, so next time, <laughs> we're going to take on all these Romans and hopefully uh, take them out. We got a decent amount of archers, decent amount of infantry. And, oh, is it going to be enough, though? So we're going to take, we're actually going to try to capture this, this city here. Let take it over it, take over it, and capture it, and hopefully we can hold this uh, ocean border here from all the Romans uh, before we go ahead and uh, go into this territory here. Enemies all around. We've made a mess of things, but at least the homeland is looking pretty.